Hey guys, welcome to example program and in this video we will see how we can write a C++ program to check for even and odd number. In this video, we will be asking the user to enter a number and then by looking at that user input, we will say whether the user has entered the even number or the odd number. Now how we can say that a number is even number or the odd number? If we divide a number by 2, then if we get the reminder as 0, then that number is said to be even number. If the reminder is a non-zero value or 1, then this number is said to be odd number. Okay, now we know about the even and odd number, but how we can get the reminder when we divide a number by 2? For that purpose, in C++ programming language, we use an operator called as the modulus operator, which is denoted by this percentage symbol. This operator will return the reminder when we divide a number by some other number. So here in this program, we will be asking the user to enter a number and then we will calculate the reminder for that number when we divide that number by two. And then by looking at the reminder value, we will say whether the number is the even number or the odd number. Now let's take a look at how we can write the program for that. I have included the iostream header file and then we are using the namespace std. So here first let us declare some of the variables that we need. The first variable that we need is for storing the user input and I will call it as num and we need another variable for storing the reminder value calculated. I will call it as rem for reminder. Now the next thing that we do is we will ask the user to enter the number. I'm going to use the cout and I will specify the message here. The message will be enter an integer number. Then we will take the input using the cin and we will store that in the num variable. Okay. Now the next thing that we have to do is we have to calculate the reminder value and for that purpose we use the modulus operator. So what we want to do is we want to divide the number entered by the user by 2 and we want the reminder value. So here for that purpose we use the modulus operator. Here through this statement we are dividing the value stored in this num variable by 2 and then we are getting the reminder value. The reminder value that we get from this statement will be stored in the rim variable. Now here we are using the modulus operator and we are getting the reminder value when we divide this number by 2. The next thing that we do is we will check for the reminder value and we will display the appropriate message. So for that purpose we use the if statement. The condition will be if reminder variable or rem variable is containing a value of 0. Here if you are a beginner then uh, then take a note about this double equal to here. This is the comparison operator. Single equal to is the assignment operator. If the rem variable is containing a value of 0 it means that the number entered by the user is an even number. We will display a message for that by using the cout. We will display the number first and then we will say is an even number. Okay. If the rim variable is containing a non-zero value, then that means that the number entered by the user is a odd number. So we will display a message for that. I'm going to copy this cout and I'm going to paste it here in the else part and we will say odd number. Okay. Now let's build and run this. Enter an integer number. I'm going to say 23. 23 is an odd number. Okay. Let's build and run this again. And this time I'm going to enter 10. 10 is an even number. Okay. So this is how you guys can write a simple C++ program to check for even and odd number. If you like this video, then hit the like button. If you don't like it, then hit the dislike button. If you want to say something, then write that in the comment box. For more tutorials like this, subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching and I'll see you later in the next video.